Stuart Little 2. Stuart Little's Big Adventures. Stuart Little was a big part of the Little family. He lived with his mother, his father, his brother George, his sister Martha, and Snowbell, the family cat. A nicer, more loving family than the Littles could not be found. Stuart tried hard, but he did have one problem. Stuart Little was a bit, well, little. And sometimes being little could mean big trouble. Even making breakfast could land him in a sticky situation. Hold on, Stuart. I'm okay, he said after nearly falling in the jam jar. Stuart didn't let his size stop him from doing all the things bigger boys like to do. He could do flips and tricks on his skateboard. Stuart also loved to play soccer. Oh my, his mother would say. She didn't like to watch her son playing with the big boys. Mrs. Little didn't have to worry too much. Stuart spent most of the games on the bench. Every once in a while, though, Stuart's team needed him. Go, Stuart, cheered his father. Stuart headed straight for the ball as the ball headed straight for Stuart. mother thought. Stuart and George liked to build model airplanes. Stuart was especially good at putting together the plane's smallest parts. He could fit right into the cockpit. Click. Uh-oh, Stuart had started the plane. The plane gathered speed, and right when it was about to fall off the table, it soared into the air. Mayday! Mayday! cried Stuart. How do we stop this thing? Stuart flew out of the house and into the park. Ah! He yelled as he swooshed over people's heads. Crash! The plane plunged into a bush. Stuart climbed out. Phew! That was close. Though Stuart's plane was ruined, he still had his shiny red car. With it, he could ride to the rescue of an injured bird named Margolo. Go, Stuart, go! Hooray for Stuart Little! He knew you didn't have to be big to have big adventures. <laughs> <laughs> 